guys. Hello, chickadees. Let me get myself comfy here. Hi, guys. What is up? Welcome back to my channel. It's Nadia back at it again with another vlog. So, guys, I really don't know what I'm talking about today. But, hey, I'm vlogging right now because I'm about to do my makeup. I'm going to try out these NYX products for the first time. I did mention my other car drive vlog that i was gonna try this out and let you guys know what i thought so hey i'm gonna do my makeup i might as well show you guys so if you didn't watch um my video i will be trying on the nyx professional makeup can't stop won't stop there are a bunch of speed racers in my freaking town anyways can't stop won't stop if it would focus i would really appreciate that come on come on come on come on all right forget it but I also am very excited for the NYX Professional Makeup Marshmallow Primer. So we're going to try these on. I'm going to do my makeup and I'm going to talk to you guys. Just because I feel like it today. So I'm bummed out in my little home t-shirt. But it's okay because uh, today's a chill day. And yeah, so let's catch up a little bit. I just launched yesterday. I launched my new collection yesterday on cbuyamon.com. And I just want to like thank you guys because it went really well. I actually, I'm already sold out of one of the bubble candles. And now I'm thinking about like adding more different colors and scents. So stay tuned for that but yes i'm just really really thankful for all the support that i'm getting and i love you guys and this is you know a sign that if you have a dream if you have this idea that you want to do you just got to do it because you never know what's possible unless you try right all right i just moisturized my face i've been breaking out i don't know if you guys can see i really don't want to zoom into my zit but right there it's a little depressing i think it is a stress i always break out when i stress but we're gonna take it easy so i just moisturized with my clinique dramatically different moisturizing lotion you know what i feel like i have a little peach fuzz on my mustache so we're gonna shave that off the struggles of being a brown girl it's real guys the struggle is real Oh, I don't even really want to show you. All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and try the primer. Um, I mentioned this in my other video, but I love that it's a pump applicator because it just really helps with containing messes. So we're going to go ahead and prime my face. I, mm, oh, yeah, I love it because it smells like marshmallows. Oh, yeah. And it's super moisturizing. And I feel, wow. Ooh, I feel like my skin is very, like, soft and... My pores are minimized. It doesn't say anything about minimizing pores, but I feel like it did. I'll do a close-up on my skin. Yeah, um, I don't know if you guys can really tell, but I feel like my pores are just, oh. And it smells good. It's moisturizing. This is a plus. I would definitely go try this if you're in need of a new primer. Um, it's also really affordable, and the packaging is just super cute. I'm. This isn't sponsored. I just really am excited about this primer. All right, we're going to go ahead and do my makeup now. No duh. Oh, shit. Sure. I found a little caramel in my makeup bag. I love these candies. The Weathers Originals. My boyfriend thinks I'm a grandma because I always uh, I always carry these around, but they're just so long.com. But we're gonna keep that in there. So I wanna do my makeup really simple today, which is what I usually do. I just really also I'm out of makeup remover, so um lately I've been like haven't been really taking my makeup out off the way I should, so which reminds me, I should go buy some makeup remover today. We're gonna go ahead and try this. Again, this has a pump applicator. Super exciting. Um, so usually I just take a pump and just drag it. Ooh, that, ooh. I think I put a little too much, so we're gonna like blend it. I mean, not blend it, but we're gonna spread it out. My pimple. I don't know if I got the right shade. Um, I did get a little dark because I went to Mexico like twice and I went to Puerto Rico and I tanned. I tanned a lot. So let's try and see if this is even my right color. If it's not, that's a fail. Oh, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. It's a little lighter than I would like, but we're gonna try to blend it in, add a little bronzer. We can make it work. 
but I do like the foundation. I think it's a little bit too like matte for my liking, but if you're into matte, then I do recommend trying this out. So today's Wednesday, is it what? So guys, how are you all doing? How is your mental health? How is your family? How is your physical health? How are you guys doing? I'm doing great. <laughs> what am I saying? <laughs> I'm actually okay, like I'm chilling. Okay, so I do feel it is too light for me, so I either have to get a new one or just wear bronzer every time I wear this, but I do really like the coverage. It has great coverage. It, it, it was really easy to blend as well. So guys, I really don't have anything special planned today. I just want to take some content for C by Ima um and run some errands i do have packages that i need to go to the post office for i need to go to the bank my life has been like boring lately um i mean not really i don't want to say it's been boring it's been productive and i'm very thankful um that it has been productive and i'm living my dream you know living living the life um but uh, I don't know like running a business is really running a business is really a 24 hour seven days a week It's so mentally straining and people don't really talk about this, you know And I feel like people don't really talk about like the mental strain It really has on you like the constant pressure of having to make sales and getting exposure It's just a lot like sometimes I miss my nine to five because I would clock in and I would clock out and that's it I'm not gonna think about work anymore, but guys I like I need to find a way to really like relax because i'm kind of like going crazy not going crazy but i think i don't know it's just really hard to not think about what else i want to do um because i have so many ideas and so many things on my mind so what do you guys do to kind of alleviate the pressure you get from your job or your business or your passion like what do you guys do i mean i could always go on vacation but that's a little extreme Honestly, running errands kind of relaxes me um, because in a way it is product productive, but like there's no pressure in running errands. I think that's so bad because people in my generation, we always feel the need to be productive. I don't know about anyone else, but whenever I'm relaxing or watching TV or doing something that's not productive, I feel like shit. And that is so bad. Like we really have to change that way of thinking and that way of living because that's why all like most of us have high blood pressure and anxiety. It's bad. Anyways, um... So please comment down below some things you do to relax and just stop thinking about work because I don't even know what to do sometimes. I do look a little pale so we're gonna bronze it up. Go baby, go baby, go, go baby, go baby, go. We're gonna bronze the out of my face right now super exciting i was gonna go get my nails done today but then i was like i'm gonna have to sit in a chair for two hours doing nothing and that really drives me insane like i can't even go on my phone like i can't answer messages or i can't do anything when i'm getting my nails done besides if i get my toes done and it really just gives me anxiety that's why i hate getting my nails done i hate it i mean i love the after obviously but the process uh this is why i love like clip-on nails okay much better hey guys i did my mascara off camera because i don't want this to be a whole makeup video but but mm, i'm about to try the nyx lingerie extra extra large liquid lipstick in the color stripped down this is also a new item that i picked up the other day Ooh, i'm loving the applicator super cute let's try it Mm. This also smells like marshmallows. Super nice. It's super smooth. Um, and I love the color. It's definitely a me color. I love that it's like not dry. It still stays moisturizing on your lips. So I really like that. Pretty much like I don't really want to do anything else. Um, for my makeup, what I am gonna do is wear some eyeliner. I've been wearing eyeliner on my waterline lately. Um, I never used to do that. That was like a big no-no for me because I thought it always made my eyes look smaller. Um, but lately I've been loving it. I've been loving the look, so we're gonna do that today. I'm using the All May. <laughs> I'm using the All May eyeliner. Also, I hate touching my waterline, so that's why I never did it. But we're gonna do it. Oh, okay. Ooh. But see, like I feel like it really brings out your eyes once you do that on the waterline. 
but yeah i've been keeping my makeup really simple as i always do i'm acting like that's a new thing but i'm really just into just like eyeliner lipstick and a little bit of mascara loving it um okay now i'm gonna go get ready because i have to shoot some content and i'll see you guys soon so i'm at the bank and my boyfriend is a creep <laughs> my boyfriend i don't know <laughs> i don't even know what to say you know he's uh at prada buying me a bag right now he's at prada buying me a bag right now yep <laughs> Obsessed with this song. Obsessed, guys. So I have uh, left the house. I ran out a couple of my errands, and now my boyfriend is here. And I want to go to an Asian store and get some Asian stuff. And I really want to make a video of us trying them. I am in need of snacks, and there's this new place that opened up near me, so I want to check it out. And hopefully, I get some good Asian snacks because I've been craving. I have been craving. Oh, my poor man. He's in so much pain. Look at his little walking boot. Aww. So we're at the Asian Mart. Oh. Finding some pretty cool snacks. They have Cheetos. Get them. I don't know if I'm gonna like them though. We got it. Hey guys, ooh, it is bright. I can't keep my eyes open, but ooh, I can't see. Okay, hi guys. Today is Friday. It's actually the next day. I ran a little bit of errands yesterday, but I didn't really vlog because I suck. But I'm vlogging today because um, I actually I'm going to this crystal store. Um, I want to take a look at some crystals possibly purchase one i've been doing some research on like healing crystals and citrine and i just want to you know research about energy and just you know i don't know what i'm saying come on come on mila this way come on run 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 huh? mom's here it's a mommy daughter day so, um, like I was trying to tell you guys before, I want I saw this crystal store online um, near near where I live, and I really want to go. I've been researching a lot of crystals like citrine and amethyst and obsidian, and I just want to look and hopefully if I have a connection, if my energy is attracted towards a specific crystal, I don't know. We'll see. And then Mama wants to go to Home Goods, so I'm gonna take her to Home Goods. And yes, but first stop, of course, Starbucks. Candles. Oh my god, is this a voodoo candle? They're so cool. Look at all these crystals. Mila, why are you tearing up all my graduation balloons? <laughs> you smelling my camera? Mila! Mila! I take your balloon! I take your balloon! Oh my goodness! Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> You're cute! Hey guys, so I just came back from running errands with my mom and I wanted to show you guys what I got from the crystal store. I'm really excited. This is my first time at one of these places and it was just so cool. I wish I knew, like I wish I had more knowledge about, you know, the significance of each crystal and what energy and what power they have. Um, but I do, I did go into the store knowing that I definitely wanted to get amethyst, citrine, and quartz. 
So I'll show you guys what I got. So the first thing I picked up, I already opened it, were just some incense. Um, I just picked up some incense because uh, I just wanted some. I've actually never had them. Um, I actually lit one in my living room downstairs and I'm gonna light one in my um, upstairs right now. But these are just the essential essences of the old and new world. Energy, body, mind, and spirit incense Stick, sticks or whatever that is. <laughs> All right, and then I just got like some little crystals and I love that they uh, come with information slip. So whatever crystal you want, they have a little pamphlet on it and what they do. So I am going to read it to you guys. So I actually got a crystal keychain um, because I just want to keep it with me at all times. Um, this I believe is quartz. Um, hold on, let me find the informational pocket. Okay, yeah. So this is rose quartz. Quartz. I'm gonna show you guys a little bit more if, if that's focusing, but it's so pretty. I love the color. It's like a baby pink. I know my nails are horrible, <laughs> but it's like a baby pink, and I'm just gonna keep them keep this with me all the time. So let me read the information. Rose quartz is a stone of universal love. It restores trust and harmony in relationships, instilling unconditional love. It purifies and opens the heart at all levels to promote love, self-love, friendship, deep inner healing, and feelings of peace. Reassuring and calming, it helps to, it helps to comfort in times of grief. It dispels negativity and protects against environmental pollution. It encourages forgiveness and acceptance for yourself as well as for others. Let's give it a let's give a round of applause for the rose. Bowl. I'll tell you guys the prices of everything if you want to check it out. So the keychain was eight dollars, which I thought was a really good deal. So this crystal right here is amethyst and it's so pretty. Um, I asked the girl where I should put this and she said anywhere but she puts it near her bed. So I might do that but it's so pretty. I love it. I think I'm going to keep it on my night table. Um, super dope. Amethyst is a powerful protection and healing stone. It transmutes negative energy into love and protects the wearer from all types of harm. Amethyst is a natural tranquilizer. It relieves stress and strain. That's what I need. It soothes irritability, balances mood swings, and dispels anger, rage, fear, and anxiety. I love that. There's a lot more, but I don't wanna. If you guys want to read about it, I'm sure you can. So I just thought this was so cute. This is only six dollars, so I'm definitely gonna put that on my nightstand. And then I got just like a few of these uh, little um, crystals as well. The shop was so cute. They had so many crystals, and they were just so pretty. Okay, so this over here is citrine, and this is actually what I originally went to the store for super cute i believe it was only a dollar okay so citri citrine or citrine i really don't know how to pronounce it but citrine is a happy stone and energizes every level of life it attracts wealth prosperity and success it impacts joy wonder delight and enthusiasm while raising self-esteem and self-confidence so this is what i researched before i went and i really wanted this i didn't see any big ones but this will do for now. And then I also got black obsidian and black tourmaline. Black obsidian is truth enhancing. It is a strongly protective stone and forms a shield against negativity. It blocks psychic attack and absorbs negative energies from the environment. And then black tourmaline is the ultimate protection stone. It protects against all kinds of negativity ranging from electronic radiation from TVs and computers to negative people, psychic attacks, past lives, and spells. Black tourmaline aids in understanding oneself and others. It promotes confidence, inspiration, compassion, tolerance, and prosperity. Black tourmaline is a little bit, it's a little bit uh, more of a matte black, and then obsidian is a little bit shiny. But yeah, that's basically all I got. I'm really excited um, about all of these. It was a really cute store. The name of it is A Time for Karma. It's in Rockville Center in New York, if you are from New York, if you're interested. So I am going to find places to put my crystals and I'm gonna light my incense. And I'm gonna edit this video. I'm excited that I went out to get crystals today because I don't know, I just I just feel better. I don't know, I just feel positive energy already. I don't know if it's a mental thing or you know, I really do believe in crystals and 
of the universe and auras i really do believe in that so i feel less stressed already i mentioned yesterday that i was just really stressed but yeah so definitely go check out the shop if you are in the new york area it's very cute in there i'm going to end the vlog here um thank you guys so much for watching i hope you are all staying safe and healthy and happy and just you know living your best life don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more content. I, I upload every Friday and yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video.